Assalamu alaikum students Today we start exercise 4.3 Now here we type 5 radical question Question involving radical expression of the variable are called radical question to solve a radical question we first obtain an equation free from radicals every solution of radical question is also a solution of radical free question but the new question have solution that are not solution of the original radical question such extra solution or roots are called extraneous roots which do not satisfy the original question the method method of the solution of different type of radical question is illustrated by meaning of the following examples the question of the form a x square plus b x plus m and radical sign equal to zero here we have example one now we let radical value equal to y then scaling both side we move plus one to the right hand side it becomes minus one and then multiply it by three Now the given question become a quadratic question 3y square minus 2y minus 5. Now factorize it. Do all steps there. 3y square minus 2y minus 5. 3 5s are 15. Now its factors are also 5 and 3. Now factorize and get the values y is equal to 5 by 3 and y is equal to minus 1 where y is equal to radical value x square plus 5x plus 1 no equal to 5 by 3 and then solve it like that we have y is equal to 5 by 3 we put value of y then scaling both sides in denominator we have 9 we multiply by 9 and then again simplify the quadratic equation and now factorize it and we get the values of x 1 by 3 and x 16 over 3 <coughs> and next we have y is equal to minus 1 and y is equal to square root x square plus 5x plus 1 scaling both sides square of minus 1 is plus 1 and 1 removed by 1 we common x from left hand side and then both values equal to 0 now we have 4 answers we check which one the original solution on checking it is found that we put all these values in the question main question and then we decide 0 and minus 5 do not satisfy the given equation therefore 0 and minus 5 being extraneous roots which roots not satisfy the given equation these are called extraneous roots hence the solution set is 1 over 3 and 16 over 3 Now second type of these equation we have radical signs and under these there are all linear equations. Now we directly scaling both sides and we get on left hand side we apply a square plus b square plus 2ab and on right hand side only single value we remove its radical sign by scaling now we move all the values except radical to the right hand side 
and at the end there is 2 10 and 2 we divide by 2 to simplify and in radical sign we multiply these two values x plus 8 multiplied by x plus 3 scaling again we have on left hand side we remove radical sign on right hand side when we scare these two values it becomes a square plus b square plus 2ab and then we move all values on the same side and then factorize it if you feel its factors are difficult then you can apply quadratic formula but its factors are easy because difference of 24 and 23 is 1 and we also required 1 so its factors are 23 by 24 and 1 on checking 23 over 24 is an extraneous road hence solution is only 1 in previous question we have all values are linear and in this question we have all values are quadratic and we first of all all we factorize all the quadratic equations first is x square plus 4x minus 21 its factor is x plus 7 and x minus 3 second is x square minus x minus 6 its factor or x plus 2 x minus 3 and then is 6x square minus 5x minus 39 its factor or 6x plus 13 and x minus 3 the given question can be written as now we write their factors and you find one factor common in all three radical values then we common this factor and now we have two questions one is x minus 3 is equal to 0 and other is like the previous example and then scaling both sides of both questions when we scare x minus 3 it gives x equal to 3 and second equation we solve same in like previous example scaling both sides in left hand side we get a square plus b square plus 2ab on right hand side 6x plus 13 we move all the values to the right hand side except radical sign and then again scaling both sides on left hand side we remove radical sign and on right hand side we apply the scare formula a square plus b square plus 2ab then again we move all the values on the left hand side and factorize it 3 tens are 30 its factor to make product is 30 and sum is 1 or six and five minus six plus five do all step here now that we have the roots three two and five by three but on verification five by three is an extraneous root and solution set is two and three now we have another form two radical sign and one is linear form in radical sign we have quadratic equations and all these values are different we let one radical sign is equal to a and other radical sign is equal to b though we scare these two values and subtract right hand side minus by right hand side and left hand side minus by left hand side when first we take their square and then subtract these values 
the equation can be written as and if we put a and b in the question we get a minus b is equal to x minus 5 and this is your equation number 2 equation 1 is a square minus b square is equal to x square minus 25 we get it when we square these values and subtract and now we divide first question by the second question in first question a square minus b square is equal to x square minus 25 it becomes a minus b a plus b and x minus 25 and x plus 5 and we divide it by second question now a plus b is equal to x plus 5 we add question 2 and 3 when we add these questions 2 and 3 b minus and b plus cut each other a plus a is 2a and same on the right hand side 2x and a is equal to x now a is equal to this question 3x square minus 7x minus 30 scaring both side and x square move to the left hand side and then factorize 2 30s are 60 and factor of 60 to make 7 are 12 and 5 do all steps and it's factors are on checking we find that minus 5 by 2 is an extraneous roots therefore solution set is 6 ok students do all these examples and then if you have any problem then send it to me jazakallah